If you're looking for a fast action movie that will keep you on the edge of your seat the whole time, The Protégé starring Maggie Q, Samuel L. Jackson, and Mike Michael Keaton is in theaters now. Okay. Big names. Lauren Kelly has more with Maggie and the brand new film. And Lauren, so is it true that Maggie did most of her own stunts in the movie? That is correct, Derek. For the past 20 years, Maggie Q has performed most of her stunts in shows and movies, and of course did so for this movie, The Protégé. I got to chat with the actress all about her latest role as an assassin who travels the world with the man who raised her completing high-profile jobs. Man, th this film is a ride for sure. I'm super action packed, great characters, obviously my wonderful co-stars who are incredible in this movie. Um, I really I really think that audiences are gonna go in thinking they're just gonna see, you know, an action movie they've seen before. Um, and I think they're gonna leave getting something very different. Samuel L. Jackson, Michael Keaton, just to name a few, yourself. But I want to talk about your stunts. There's some incredible sure. stunts in the movie that I know that you performed some of them, and you actually trained under Jackie Chan earlier on? Back in the day, yeah, a long time ago. I was living and working in Hong Kong at the time doing um, sort of Hong Kong films. You know, Jackie was producing movies at the time. I think he still is, but producing movies for the, the new generation of, of action stars. And so I was in a few of those, and that was kind of where I got my start. But I got to bring it back here. A couple of months before this film, you had spinal surgery, but you yes. still were able to do this. How is that possible? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, my doctor certainly was not happy about it. Uh, <laughs> I think there was a lot of no's on his end, and then on my end there was a lot of, but I have to. Um, and he's just shaking his head. Although I, I will have to say, you know, if people see this movie and they know that he did my surgery, I think I'm the best, don't you think? I mean, wouldn't I be the poster child for going to him? Absolutely, for sure. So. Give me your doctor's name. I'll have that on You're hand. Welcome. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, Maggie, when it comes to performing in stunts like this in an action movie, what is the hardest wardrobe to try to get around doing that in? You know, I have a lot to say with wardrobe when it comes to films like this because I know what I can wear so that I can move. So these costume designers, you know, they come in going, wouldn't this be fabulous? And I'm like, yeah, that's great. But this is what I'm going to wear because <laughs> it has to be practical. So I'm, I'm that person where I'm like, yeah, that's cute, but... I've got to do things. I, I've got it's to jump. Like, like the jeans, really cute, but I, I cannot do these action can't, stunts. Can't bend in those. Yeah, and they always like to put you on a heel. I'm like, that's not happening. So it's really funny that back and forth. You know, they, they bring the fashion, I bring the practicality. Absolutely. Maggie, you're a pleasure to talk to. We Thank cannot you, wait to catch you in the protege. It is in theaters now alongside Michael Keaton, Samuel L. Jackson. It's going to be a wild ride throughout the entire movie. We thank you for stopping by and chatting with us today. So you guys grab the popcorn. The Protégé starring Maggie Q, Samuel L. Jackson, and Michael Keaton is now in theaters. You guys, isn't that incredible? She trained with Jackie Chan. Like, she was his protege, like, yeah. in real life. Can you imagine? It's so incredible. I mean, her resume, too, is just quite extensive. Mm -hmm. I love this cast. It's great to see Michael Keaton back in a film, too, like this. It just looks action-packed. I was just reading uh, during, your, during your package a little more about Maggie, and, you know, when she was 17 years old, she was, like, a model, mm -hmm. and her name is Margaret Quigley. Yep. But she changed her name to Maggie Q because it was easier for people right. to say. But she has a great story of moving around the world, trying to move, you know, to Hong Kong and Taipei. She had 20 bucks in her pocket. So it's, I always love a story about someone who just knew what they wanted to do and went for it, even when it got tough. Worked really hard to get there. And the and movie looks out. fantastic. Absolutely. Super talented. Yeah. Thanks, Lauren. Sure, guys. I do appreciate it.